Legoland was seeing stars Thursday for its grand opening of Star Wars Miniland. <laughs> Cutting the ribbon on the 1.5 million Lego brick exhibit was none other than the original Princess Leia, Carrie Fisher, and her new friend Carson, a nine-year-old with leukemia whose wish was to enjoy Legoland. <laughs> See, there's a good boy. He doesn't know who my mother is. Among the first to arrive at Star Wars Miniland were Gina Lee Nolan from Baywatch and her family. We love Legoland. We've been a fan for years, and my husband's a huge fan of Star Wars as well as, as my kids. So, um, we're, you know, we're here to celebrate. We're going to meet Princess Leia today. It's going to be fun. Also on the red carpet, and no newbie to Legoland, actor Christian Slater. I've been here before at least a dozen times, I think. My, my children are uh, 11 and 9, so over the years, we have uh, certainly grown up at Legoland. Enjoying Legoland was top priority for Nolan Gould, who stars in ABC's Modern Family. He tells Carl's Red Patch he's got enough Legos at home to probably build a mini land. I'm going to enjoy it. We, we, we drove a long way to get here, so... I'm just going to go and run around like a little kid. Yeah. Former Carlsbad resident and pro skater Tony Hawk brought his kids to the event. He remembers seeing Star Wars on a field trip with his elementary school class. We asked him if he ever took a field trip to the world's first skate park built right here in Carlsbad in the late 70s. I didn't get to go there because it was before my time. My dad drove us there once after it was closed, and a guy came out of a trailer with a shotgun and told us to get out. And so that was the only time I got to go to Carlsbad Skate Park. No shotguns at this Carlsbad event, but plenty of laser guns, Legos, and Yoda. At Legoland, California, Deanne Goodman, Carlsbad Patch. <laughs> if it's a Titanic, he wants it. 